AP European History is a class that you can take as an elective your junior or senior year. It does not replace, however, the AP US History or AP Government and Economics credit, which is required to graduate. However, it's an awesome class that allows you to dive deeper into information that you may not have learned sophomore year, such as the French Revolution, European monarchs and all of their wild behaviors, uh, the World Wars, other events during the 1800s uh, that typically get skimmed over in the more survey history classes. Although the course does have textbook reading and it is an AP level course, it is an elective, meaning that there are more activities and other different types of projects that are not necessarily available in other required content history classes. AP European History can offer you an elective AP credit when you go to college. Even if you're not planning on becoming a liberal arts major at a university, because it's an elective, it will take the place of a basic elective course. However, although it's a fun class, there's lots of fun things and neat things that we get to do. Um, do remember that it is an AP course with an AP exam at the end of the year. Though it's not required as a prerequisite, it is encouraged that you have had taken either GT Humanities, AP World History, or AP Euro US History prior to taking AP European History. That's only because the exams for all four of those courses are exactly the same. That means the good news is that you have, if you have already taken at least one of those courses, you are already familiar with the writing and the style of the course and the way that the exam itself is laid out. AP Euro covers the four periods in European history. The first period starts in 1450 and covers the Renaissance through King Henry VIII. Then the course dives into the 1700s with Peter the Great and the Seven Years' War. From there, the class talks about the 1800s with the Irish Potato Famine and the Balkan Wars. Finally, you get to discuss the World Wars and the Cold War through present day. You should, took, you should take AP Euro History because unlike the other classes like AP US and AP uh, World History, the chapter notes aren't as harsh and also we get to do fun projects and have a great time in the class.